Steven makes a quick change before the start of this one as we are underway. Brady takes possession off the opening faceoff in his own zone. Goes quickly up the right wing side. That's going to go the distance. It out as Christensen kept it in at the line. Looks, passes for Crandall. Bounced over his stick. He's got it now. Goes back to the point for Payne. Payne fakes. Looks, fires. That was blocked. Payne there to keep it in deep for a moment. McPherson's going to be unable to clear. And now Sherwood Park takes possession back. Crandall walks in. Fires. Stopped by Fusion. Rebound scores. Carmelo Crandall in front of the net. Solves Zach Onescu. And Sherwood Park's got a 1-0 lead. Off as Cocksmith was looking to bring it in. Eventually it's clawed over the line by Sherwood Park. But that should just about do it. It's done. We'll go up the left wing boards. Uh, it'll go the distance. But would have been an icing call. But the buzzer sounds. And 20 minutes in the books here in game four, the Shore Park Crusaders. We will get back underway here as Monroe takes the draw against Ben and Casa, and the second period is underway. That pass. Hard stop from Howard as he takes it down low, dishes off for Crandall. Crandall to Wills. Backdoor feed for Howard, and they score. Sherwood Park's got a 2 0 lead. What a pass from Noah Wills. Hauer on the doorstep. He's got two points. So does Crandall. Sherwood Park's got a 2-0 lead. 18-24 left to go here in the second period. As soon as Sherwood Park touches up, Saints looking to avoid that. As Oakenfold works in, drops back to the point, slides it across. Magrill, shot, stop, rebound. They score on the doorstep. It's Carter Oakenfold. And the Spruce Grove Saints with the extra attacker cut into the Crusaders' lead. It's 2-1. Back up top for Payne. Drag back to Hauer. Down low for Wills. Backhand on goal. What a save. Banging away at it. The puck is loose. And eventually it's directed to the corner. Net goes off its moorings. Pushing and shoving in front of Onescu. Minute himself one back by Spruce Grove. They'll look to sit on this. Monroe trying to work it free. Fugston on top of it. And that will do it for 40 minutes of action here in game number four. Face off one back by Howard. Big time draw one by the Crusaders center. Flip down the ice. That just misses Miller looking for a duplicate of game seven where he scored in a very similar manner into the empty net. Trying to get it to Christensen. Couldn't do so. Puck stays loose. Sherwood Park able to flip it down the ice. That one's going to roll. It could have enough. And it does. It's an empty net goal for Zach Maxwell. And Sherwood Park's got a 3-1 lead. 58.1 seconds left to go in the third period. Running out on the Saints. Worked in the zone. Chabot gets it to Babbage. He works in. Fires. Roos makes the save. Rebound. Somehow that stays out. Evan Arnold able to work it out to center. And that will do it as the Sherwood Park Crusaders stave off elimination here in game four as they take it by a 3-1 to one final. And we'll play game five at the Grant Fuhrer Arena in Spruce Grove on Friday night, 7 p.m. Puck drop.